Hey everybody, today we're going to go over adding launch control to your ALH TDI. Um, some people like to call it two-step, it's not really because it works different because it's a diesel, but uh, anyway, so we'll get on to how to do it. Alright, first open up EDC Suite, open your file. This is just a stock ALH file for the example. Go over to Actions, activate Launch Control. Now over here you'll have Launch Control Maps. Open it up. Right click there. Edit access and then change this to 2200. Then you got to save your change. Close it. up so we can see it all all right well, oops i'm uh well when i made my change i got rid of that so you just have to go back and do this again and there's that so at roughly 2247 It'll cut fuel and then at 2200, it'll get fuel back and it will do your desired limiter at that RPM. You can set it to whatever RPM you want and speed. So this is how you would set up your actual like traction launch control. So this is just at zero kilometers an hour, um, but it would, you would just um, take time and figure out your um, desired amount of wheel spin at what speed and you could limit the RPM for your different wheel speeds and kind of do a graph like this to get it up to um, your however you want to set it up. But this just sets up uh, your limiter at 2247. So after you have that done, then you need to save your changes to the map. And then you can um, file, save as, save it as whatever you want launch save it and there you go and then you just got to flash that on your car and that's a quick little how to do it all right so that was just a quick little uh, how to do it it's pretty simple so i didn't go into too much detail um if you like this give me a like and subscribe just uh helps me know that you guys are actually interested in this stuff and i'll keep making more I uh, yes, uh, peace.